it just comes in waves When you ask me if I'm okay I don't have a lot to say Can I tell you something? It's exam day guys Whoop whoop I'm so excited <laughs> I just want to get this over. I'm now going to have a little bit of my granola and then at 9.45 I have my first exam today. So I'm going to be heading to school in a bit. But yeah, my hair is looking a little bit crazy. I know, I know. See you guys afterwards. My college is actually so far like I have to drive like a nice 30 minutes to maybe 40 minutes to get there. And I think that's wrong. Considering my, my second day was like two minutes away from me, so I've got a nice drive to kind of think and calm my nerves and even have nerves. But oh, I think there's traffic. Guess who's home? First exam down. I feel very good. I feel motivated. I feel positive. So no more thinking about it. What's done is done. Everything now is out of my hands. So there's no point stressing about it. We just gotta focus on the next one. But now I'm gonna treat myself to a nice little wheat bix because I think we all know a gem loves wheat bix and I gotta treat myself for all the hard work that I've done this morning. Don't I? Yeah, of course I do. Oh. Time for some dinner, chopped up some sweet potato that I'm just gonna throw into my air fryer. And I have some leftover meatballs from yesterday, so there's no point in me cooking because leftovers are actually so nice. I love leftovers. So I'm gonna just throw some sweet potato in the air fryer, make up a quick salad. Good morning. Well, actually, it's not morning, but we move. Happy Tuesday, everyone. Actually, hold on. No, today's Wednesday. What am I saying? Happy Wednesday, everyone. Today, I had some breakfast after my workout. I was going to go on a walk, but the weather is honestly disgusting. It was so nice and sunny yesterday, and it said it was going to be warmer today, but it's literally just grey skies and rain. Anyway, I done up a little to-do list for today so that I'm on track with what I need to do. And yes, I'm in the living room because sometimes when I'm just cooped up in my room for too long, I feel like my brain just stops working. So it's nice to just change it up a little bit. That's what we have planned for today. So this is our little to-do list for today. We've got a study session at four. We've got to do some quizlets for one of the units in my next exam. Gonna have to catch up on some questions, recap some studies, of course. And then hopefully we can go for a little bit of a grocery run if the weather turns out to look a little nicer later on in the day. And I also need to book a nail appointment because do I need to explain like these are looking so hideous right now and I've got a little bit of ink on them obviously because of the pens that I've been using these days and they just won't come off but anyway I don't want to show you my nails too much because they look horrible so we move <laughs>
of self-control it takes for me to not finish all of these cookies right now is incredible but they are done and honestly my sister-in-law has actually perfected this recipe because it's so good would you just would you just just that <laughs> oh my god i'm gonna have some of these now with a cup of tea and i'll see you guys later exams are finished guys so i just done my last exam yes we have skipped a whole week in time because honestly for the whole week i didn't even do anything i literally just woke up i ate i revised i slept i basically ate the same thing every single day because revising was my priority you know so i didn't want to bore you guys with that content because honestly even i didn't want to watch it back myself so yes today's the following tuesday exams are done a whole weight has been lifted off of my shoulders i have been waiting to do these exams for a fat year so you can imagine the stress i felt this whole year i am boiling right now i have just come for my nail appointment because you've got to treat yourself obviously we're gonna go get our nails done and i'm so excited because i already know what i want to get now that those are done we are not thinking about the exams we're just going to pump out all the positive energy that we can into the universe because a law of attraction guys i honestly believe in it so yeah the matter is out of our hands now and now we can go and have fun we can go out we can do whatever we want and since yesterday restrictions are now a little bit more lenient so we can go indoors we can go restaurant indoors everything i'm just so excited but before i'm late to my appointment let's go and get our nails done nails are done oh my god amazing amazing beautiful oh my god i had severe fomo when i saw these so i was like okay a gem you are getting them done next time i think it's time to go for a little bit of a grocery shop but why not let's stock up the house with some nice things to eat next few days we're probably going to be watching a lot of films a lot of binge watching so we need some nice snacks to snack on no. So we just got home from Audi and we actually had a bigger shop than I expected today but we're gonna do a little bit of a grocery haul. Now the first thing that I actually got is flowers because ladies and gents you don't have to wait for a significant other to buy you flowers you can buy yourself some flowers because you deserve them on to the rest of our shopping first up we got some hummus now this was the beetroot hummus that i was telling you guys about this is so yum and they had some in stock so got some hummus and this was new i've never seen it before so i don't know if it's actually new or if i've never seen it let's see how it tastes i'm probably gonna like it no matter what because this, is there anything i don't like next we've got some so yogurt usually i get alpro ones but aldi's own brand tastes exactly the same same thing with peanut butter i usually get pip and nut but once again aldi's own brand literally is the exact same in terms of consistency and taste so give that a 10 10 got some greek yogurt some tomatoes some cherry tomatoes we have some green beans lately i've been craving a lot of lemonade and sometimes when i've really got a sweet tooth a can of lemonade just kind of settles it out for me i don't know why but it's really nice we got some almonds some chia seeds and some pasta because when i see different shaped pasta i can't help myself but get some so we've got this style and this which i've never seen before next up we've got some fruit i had to pick up some kiwi two packets of banana yes i know we have some but i couldn't help it this is the next batch and that is some spare so by the time these are done these will be ready Edgem's tactics some pears we got some oranges granny smith apples a mango and would you believe it this was the only fruit that they had that was loose aldi really needs to step up the game in terms of plastic packaging because clearly they aren't doing the best next up i actually all these pizza bases this is the same brand as the sweet potato wraps that i really like to get so when i saw this i was like hmm we might need to give that a go and of course i had to get some mozzarella with that because i love fresh mozzarella on its own and on my pizza 
Some more fruit, we got some blueberries, strawberries, raspberries and blackberries. Some breadsticks because we go through these very, very quickly as a family. I don't know what it is about them, they're just really addictive. And last but not least, some snacks for my niece and my nephew. But yeah, that is all. And we also got some oats, but that is a regular schmegla. We always get oats. Now, time to put them all away. <laughs> dinner anyways i was thinking about what to make for dinner and then i realized we've never made pasta together how is that possible like how don't ask me how because i'm asking you anyways we are gonna make some pasta together and my favorite way to actually have pasta these days is with a nice thick avocado pesto sauce it's easier than it looks and it tastes so much nicer than any store-bought ready pasta sauce don't get me wrong ready pasta sauce is nice but it's not as nice as this and all you're gonna need is some avocado some spinach and pretty much anything that you find green <laughs> She's a beautiful one. Now, I also mix in some pasta water, but I do it half a cup at a time. Look at the consistency, and depending on how much pasta you're making, you can add in more or less. And in goes our lovely pasta sauce. Voila, pasta is served. I'm so sorry, my bat died. I literally just added in some garlic into the sauce, mixed up and grated on some Parmesan cheese and we are ready to go. Now yes, the plate and everything looks amazing, but I will probably be going for some seconds, so don't worry. Ew. What number is that? One. This one? Two. Three. Ah, four, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Yes! Ring, ring. Hi. Hello. later in the day I know but basically the kids have gone now had a really nice morning with them I have also made some more granola because we go through it so often that this is kind of like a weekly thing if you haven't seen the video where I explain the recipe there is now a highlight on my Instagram where I go through what I do it's just so good mm. so for today I literally just have to get along with some editing plans for tonight is starting a new series and i think i want to start vincenzo because everyone has been hyping it up and i find it's really good so i can't wait to now start it but i've also really been into um watching like true crime series and all these weird reddit mysteries you know it's so interesting but it's also kind of creepy so don't watch it at night like i do but the thing is it's so addictive that you can't stop watching it even though you're paranoid and you're a little bit scared but you still can't stop watching it so but yeah let me get back to popping my granola away and then go back to editing because i still have quite a lot left to do 
but that's all right because it's actually kind of fun <laughs> hey can you believe i've actually been editing for the past few hours but anyways i'm knackered now so i'm about to head off to sleep so thank you so much for watching this vlog hit the like and subscribe button and i'll see you guys soon with a new video Mwah. bye